Hey everyone, and welcome back to some more Okami. And uh, I found out, or I remembered, I should say, what the, the bone reading thing was. If if I remember right, it's supposed to be Scapula Mancy. It's, uh, it's interesting. Interesting practice, for sure. But anyway, that aside, definitely thank you for tuning in. I do, as always, very much appreciate it. And uh, we'll see where we're supposed to go. I think there is a tree over here that needs our help. And I wish to assist it. At least according to the... Wait, what? The map changed. Oh no. I feel like I've mis... I've miscalculated something. Don't touch me, evil scroll. You fiend. Let's jump back down here. But it says... Oh, that makes more sense. We can get to it. I'm coming, sapling. Together we shall make everything better. As this evil tries to get me. Um, okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Whoa, almost blew myself up. Ta-da. Okay, well, there's a reason you're withered. You got no sunlight. It's kind of important for a uh, growing sapling like yourself. Well, let's get you jump started. Nope, that didn't work. There we go. Magic. It's so beautiful. This is more than even I expected. Oh, wow. Wait, the trees still aren't in bloom. We're only halfway there. Praise... See some bunnies, but first the treasure. You obtained devout beads. A new divine instrument guarded by a guardian sapling, eh? Wow, Sakia's gonna spoil you at this rate. Anyway, this is gonna make your life a whole lot easier. The monsters are gonna try to get you anyway they can. So you need to equip a good divine instrument and practice with it. But remember, there's more than simply equipping them. They can be equipped as a sub-weapon or a main weapon. A weapon's effect will differ depending on how it's equipped. You can even pull off some secret techniques with your sub-weapons. Even after your 100 year nap, you remember that much, right? I know you're not too bright, but no sweat. No thinking involved. Just try to equip that new divine instrument as a main weapon. Listen, I don't appreciate your sass. And also, this is getting way too complicated for me. I thought this would be a simple thing, but it's definitely not. Okay, so we have the reflector, which banishes evil. Um, and now we got a holy rosary capable of rapid attacks when equipped as a sub-weapon. Let's go ahead and uh, equip it then. Okay. Everything's better now, right? Got the hang of it? Well, let me give you an example. You know that mirror of yours? Well, it acts as a shield when equipped as a sub-weapon. That's kind of cool. If you're under attack, press triangle to guard with it. You should test it out on the monsters in the area. Oh, and one more thing. You remember what Sakuya said, don't you? The sacred tree in Kamiki Village will bear a guardian fruit each time a guardian sapling is revived. Make sure to stop by Sakuya's tree whenever you return to Kamiki. Will do. So how does this work? Oh, I still got that. I still got a bark. 
I'm pressing buttons. I can still do the moves. Got a map. And, uh... Oh! Okay. I'm just gonna keep doing the thing. Feed the bunnies! No, come back. Hey! Just what I needed to calm my soul. Be at peace. Oh, bunnies. Thank you for the love! Moving along. Now we gotta dig some. Dig, 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 dig. Another clover! Alright! Revive! Uh, revive! There we go. Alright! And we revived this. Now everything's good. The world is right at... Whoa! Hey, don't change camera angles on me. You know, and again, I think it does need to be said that, uh, you know, their art, art style seems, you would think, oh, hey, trying to give some compliments to the game. What's going on? Oh, hi. Oh. Hark, the call of the heavens. The earth, the sea, they summon me forth to defeat evil. Waka, the god's gift to man, is here. Bonjour. Listen, you have magnificent hair. Please, what do you use? Tao Master Waka. What's up with that guy? That crimson shading and divine instrument on your back. You look kind of weird, but I reckon you pack a punch, baby. Hey, think you're, <laughs> you're so special way up there, huh? Get down here and talk face to... Wait, did he say crimson shading? Can he see Amy's true form? Uh, obviously. Whoa. Suddenly a lightsaber. Okay. Hey, he drew a sword. Oi, this is how I get my point across. Pun intended. The moment the cursed zone started spreading across Nippon, I saw the shadowy figure that removed the sacred sword, Tsukuyomi. Flee into Kamiki Village and seal the entrance with a huge rock. You guys know anything about that? Are you threatening me? This guy gives me the creeps. Better keep your eye on him. Huh? Amy, you getting all worked up again? Magnific magnifique? Okay. I wouldn't have it any other way. Now you shall get an earful of my beloved sword. Please don't name it. Oh. Behold. Pillow talk. You need to settle down, Waka. Let's rock, baby! Listen, I got no beef with you. But I do got the moves. Oh! Ow! Oh yeah, wait, hold on. I will cut you with paint! Oh, I didn't want to dodge into you. Ow, 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 ow. Recover. Hold on, we got this. Can't touch me. You don't got the moves. Oh, that's water. Get out of the water. That's not fair. You can you can dance on water. Aha. 
You know what? Just for funsies. Nope. Can't do it then. You get back here. I'm... Ow. Not done with you. Okay. This is getting ridiculous. No, don't get in the water. What are you doing? Get out. Oh my gosh. Those swords are actually kind of mean. You get back here on land where I can fight you. Coward. First try. Nothing to it. It's been quite some time since I've tasted your power, Amy. That's enough for now. Too late now. You're the one who picked the fight. Hey, wait. You know this guy, Amy? <laughs> well, that was pretty tactless. Excusez-moi, baby. You see, I was looking into that cursed zone that struck this area. It consumed all in its path, even the light of the sun. It is the curse of Orochi, the legendary eight-headed serpent. Oh, Orochi? It's getting intense. Do not utter, <laughs> do not utter that name without reason. That alone could curse the weak of mind. Orochi was slain 100 years ago by Nagi, and stop using that name. That is the only one I struggle with. Chiranui, going with that, and it's evil. Spirit was sealed away in the moon cave which I guarded. Oh, that's right. You know, the cave in the middle of the lake over Shinshu Field? But someone has gone and freed Orochi by removing Sukuyami. Suko. Suku. Yomi. Ha. Huh. The beast's evil has caused a cursed zone to cover these lands. I never thought the sacred sword could be so easily removed. Whoever did it waited till I was back in the capital. It seems things are afoot that even I did not prophesize. <laughs> We're way ahead of you, pretty boy. We've been busy dispelling the cursed, uh, the curse left and right. That Orochi's gonna be mincemeat when we're through with it. So you're the ones who have revived the trees in this area. But a lot of time's passed since Orochi's return. You better pick up the pace. Ma chérie. Why are you using French? Why? What? I'm sorry to say, our battle just now was a big disappointment. Hey, I beat you. You're not what you used to be, Amy. You may have defeated Orochi long ago, but one cannot dwell on past glories. You have weakened greatly during your hundred-year slumber. Hey, you listen here, okay? I defeated him. I needed a nap. And I will not have you belittle me, okay? You're, you're a child compared to the hundred years plus, okay? Just saying. That's enough. Whoa, even he drew his sword. Now tell me about that shadowy figure you saw fleeing to Kamiki. How do we know it wasn't you? Relax, my little bouncing friend. Oh, I almost forgot. I have a little prophecy for you. I can see into the future, you know. Well, uh, we already spoke to the Bone Lady, who I just forgot her name, and she already covered it, so, you know, it's all good. I foresee a long and... I foresee a log and big thrills. You'll know what I'm talking about when the time comes. Anyway, I must be off. The work of a prophet is never done. Au revoir, baby.
What a freak. Who the heck does he think he is? Hey, wake up, Amy. We got work to do. Ta-da! I'll take it. Oh, damage. Wow, that's... I think that's bad. I think that's all bad. I'm just... I'm bad. Let's rock, baby! Also... I forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah. Hey, listen. I, uh... You know, the art style, as I was saying earlier, may be uh, simple, but I did not expect it to be so pretty. Oh! Save your strength. You ain't gonna open it that way. That's a giant bud. It's a strange plant that engulfs buried treasure and brings it up. But no one's ever been able to open one of these things. It's said that only the gods know the special way to make it open. You wouldn't happen to know, would you? Listen, I know all, okay? Um, but I'm guessing I can't because this isn't doing its normal thing. Nope. Uh... Nope. Oh, I got it. You obtained Holy Bone S. Amy's favorite snack. Restores three units of solar energy. Speaking of, how are we doing on that? Because that battle... Yep, I will be taking one of those now. Oh, ten. Wait, but I only want three. Yes. Ta-da. Thank you. And, um... I'll take that. You obtained lacquerware set. Each piece of this Japanese lacquerware is said to be unique. I'd imagine so. Okay, I'm lost and there is way too much water here. I don't like water. Hey, what's going on over here? Hey there, buddy. With, uh... Why do you have a dead bunny on your head? How dare you? Oh, poor Umi. I wonder if he's okay. Oh, hello there, doggy. You all alone too? I'm Kokari. Kokari. Going with that. Pleased to meet you. Boy of the forest, Kokari. What? This? This is my fishing pole. Actually, there's no fishing line or hook on it right now. But there's a reason for that. Oh, you got some storm clouds brewing. You need to, uh, settle down. Oh, more talking. My dog Umi and I were exploring a secret place the other day. An ancient building known as the... Sada Ruins? Suda Suota Ruins. Okay. We'd never been able to get into the ruins until we found... A key deep in the forest. But when we went in, we heard a horrible roar from deep within. I didn't waste any time getting out of there. I locked the entrance to the ruins and hightailed it home. And let me guess, you left your... Oh no. I thought Yumi had followed me, but he was nowhere to be found. I bet he's trapped back at those ruins. He must be crying, all scared and alone. If you know where he is, then why don't you go rescue him? This is no time to be fishing. Yes, well, there's a reason for that, you see. On my way home from the ruins, I fell near the water's edge and in went the key. I've tried my hardest to fish it back out, but I've lost all my line and hooks. All I have now is this pole. Wah! Sounds like you need to start swimming. I've tried my hardest to fish out the key to the ruins, but... I've lost my line and hooks. All I have now is this pole. Oh, uh... I thought it said when it was green that I, I keep talking to him. Um, but he's just repeating now. Oh, there we go. Man, this kid's a crybaby. Give him a good headbutt, Amy. Maybe that'll straighten him out. Okay. Boop. Ouch. Now cut that out. There's nothing I hate more than a crybaby. You were the one who left your dog in those dangerous ruins. Yeah, I agree. 
So you gotta do whatever it takes to get the key and go help him. But, but, but... Listen here, kid. Fishing's all about attitude. Attitude! There's nothing you can, can't can catch with the right attitude. Fish babes or whatever. It all can be yours. Go ahead. Act like you're having fun. We'll watch. That's kind of creepy. Boy, this murky water sure gives me the creeps. People call it Deep Abyss because they can't see the bottom. But that's not why these waters are famous. Legend has it a humongous fish swallowed the moon reflected on the surface of the water. No one knows if the legend is true, but to this day the moon never rises here in Agate Forest. Agata. Agate? What? No, Agata Forest. Give the fairy tales a rest, will ya kid? They're so gloomy. Think more positive. Have fun. Fun! Okay, Amy. Let's use that celestial brush of yours to help him out. There should be some fishing line on his pole, but there's not. Well, let's make some by drawing a line from the pole to a fish. Oh, oh, this is going to be interesting. Um, so yeah, you draw a line connecting the pole to the fish, and a line does its thing. Whoa! Hey, I drew the... There we go. Whoa! Did I actually get a bite? Careful now, kid. Don't pull with all your might. You'll just wear yourself out. Just reel it in nice and slow. Oh, I'm doing this... Hey. Hey. Oh, this works. I think this is working. Oh! Oh, what? Okay, wait. We can do this. Hold on. Try it again. We got it. We got it. Nope, nope. That's the wrong button. Draw! What am I drawing? A sure! You caught Gobi. Okay, let's, uh, let's try for this big fish this time. Whoa, I actually get a... I actually did get a bite. Okay. Be all happy. Wee! Happy. Happy, happy. 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 And then we go... Boop. You caught killifish. Oh, that is a big fish. Oh my gosh. Whoa, did I actually get a bite? Yes, you did. And I got you. Oh, this fish is kind of hard. Hey, you know, for a fishing game, this isn't that bad. Oh, nope, pull it the other way. Got it. The other way. We got it. Oh, yeah. It's a big fish. You caught giant salmon. Salmon. Listen. Don't judge me. It has the key. Wow, that's a big one. Hmm? Blet. Hey! Th that's the ruins key. It popped right out of the mouth of that big old fish. Now I can go save Umi over at the ruins. I'm gonna go all the way in this time. No running away for me now. Oh, yoink. Hey, give that back. <laughs> Good move, Amy. We can't have this kid getting hurt on your watch. Well, what are we waiting for? We got a lost dog to find in Tasuda Ruins. Hey, kid, you can... Oh, my gosh, she's trying to punch me. Kid, back off. Where are the ruins? Um, I think they're... I hope I can swim with this thing. I can. Okay. Uh, that's evil. We'll get back to that in a moment. I want to go save the dog.
Oh, that's also... Oh, that's just lots of badness everywhere. It's okay, that's a deer. Hi, deer. Ta-da! Well, let's go look for that kid's dog. I'm actually hoping we might find something more. Nobody's entered these ruins for ages, right? Just think about it. There could be a fabulous treasure <laughs> hoard hidden in there. <laughs> but enough talk. Let's start looking. I agree. Let's get this treasure first. You obtained enhancing weapons. Scroll drawn by wandering artists. Contains useful information. Okay, wait, hold on. I wonder if there's a save point in there, because I kind of... Whoa, hey. Hey, it's Susano. Just blazing about, as always. Uh, let's feed you first. I'm guessing... You probably want this. Oh, so serene. And peaceful. Moving along. Thank you for the love. I appreciate it. Actually, let's go jump in here. This should be a save point in here. Or not. Hello. No, please no. Suda, Suda Ruins. That oh, looks dark. Even the symbol for it's kind of dark. Puppers, where are you? That's a pretty oddly shaped statue. Look at all that moss. Must have been here for ages. And what's up with that weird water? I don't think you want to go jumping in there, furball. How about drawing some lily pads so we can check it out? Listen, how about I save first, huh? Okay, and with that, we're going to go ahead and do the indie thing like we always do. But definitely thank you for... Oh, that's... Oh, that's a tree. Definitely thank you for tuning in, and I uh, hope you enjoyed course until the next one which I hope to catch you in definitely be awesome and take care